Today's announcement does concern rapid transit. It does concern a major employment initiative by the province of British Columbia. I have a snapshot to set the scene. The extension of the ALRT into Surrey will provide 2,000 man years of jobs for our people in British Columbia. It's coming to Vancouver. Rapid transit. Rapid transition. A whole new way of city life. From sea bus along the city waterfront to the Dunsmuir Tunnel. Deep under the downtown core to Burrard Station. Burrard Street at Dunsmuir. Then Granville Station. The stadium. Main Street, Broadway, on to Burnaby, and all the way to New Westminster in just 27 minutes. That's just the first phase. Phase two already announced into Surrey. Then comes the line to Coquitlam, all greater Vancouver eventually. Sea bus to stadium in four minutes flat. Six minutes from Burrard to Broadway at Commercial Drive. Traveling up to 75 kilometers an hour. Trains two minutes apart in rush hour. Running from 5 a.m. to 1 next morning, seven days a week. With easy access for everyone. Elevators and escalators. No steps to hinder seniors and handicapped people. Parking slots for wheelchairs in every car. This is everybody's people mover. Clean, comfortable, convenient, and integrated. Sea bus and buses will work with rapid transit, moving people to and from stations. 75 bus routes will be reorganized. Tickets will be integrated to European system. Serve yourself. There will be monthly fare cards, multi-ride tickets, all on the honor system. Random inspectors to keep us honest. There are no drivers. This is advanced rapid transit. Central controllers working central computers, cross-checking everything at the speed of light. The control center and the maintenance yards are out near 20th Street in New Westminster. Every car has a telephone direct to the control center. Every station has video cameras scanning. We'll have roving uniformed attendants and plainclothes security staff. Need a doctor? Call. Need the police? Call. They'll be waiting at the next station. Speed of light. This is where we cross the Grandview Cut, 10 minutes from Seabus. The guideway is 80 feet above ground here. Building the system means 2,000 construction jobs, the equivalent of 5,500 people working for a full year. That's just the direct employment. For every pay packet earned on the project, there's another job created elsewhere. Supermarkets, gas stations, you name it. Adds up to 11,000 person years of work and that's not all. BC companies are manufacturing much of the technology here. Not just for our system, but for other systems in other cities. That means long-term jobs. Look around you. New construction projects are shaping up along the line. Like Metrotown in Burnaby. New commercial, retail, and residential construction. New hotels, 
we'll see new regional town centers, new investment, and new jobs. A whole new way of city life. Rapid transit means rapid transition. Smooth, quiet, and quick. Just 18 minutes from sea bus to Royal Oak. You know how we take visitors for rides around the city. Stanley Park, Point Grey, along the North Shore. We'll do it on transit now. Sea bus across the harbor. Rapid transit to New Westminster. Back in time for tea. No traffic jams, no pollution. Get off along the way and stroll in the park between stations. One long park all the way. Stanley Park seawall clear to New Westminster. Jogging, cycling, strolling between neighborhood parks. Beautiful landscaping. All due for completion and time for Expo 86. Millions of visitors from all over the world moving between Canada Place on the harbor and the False Creek Exhibition Grounds. Discovering a new mature Vancouver, a world-class city in fact, with advanced rapid transit. Sea bus to New Westminster in just 27 minutes. Thank <laughs> you.